Today I'll be giving you some information and a close up look at the Disney 100 medallions that you can find at the Disneyland and Walt Disney World resorts. I'll show you how to buy them, how much they cost, and the best part is I will give you a list of the location of each and every medallion design. So if you have a trip coming up and you want to collect all of these, you can use this as a guide and find them all if you're up for the challenge because there are a lot of these. So we'll start with what these are. So as part of the Disney's 100 Years of Wonder celebration, they created these Disney 100 collectible medallions, which feature various Disney characters on the front and they have a design on the back. So there are currently 48 medallions at the Disneyland Resort and 69 medallions at the Walt Disney World Resort. So overall, that is 117 different medallion designs and they may release more as the year goes on. So if you do wanna collect all of these, it might be quite a challenge, but it'll be a fun challenge. <laughs> The medallions are sold in vending machines and each machine has four designs. So at the top of the machine, you're going to see the four medallion designs that are in there. And then also at the bottom where you select which coin you want, you're gonna see the design that you want. So if you just want a Moana one, you can click that and it'll give you the Moana medallion. So each medallion is $6 or you can buy all four for 20. So if you do like all four designs or you're trying to collect them all, you're gonna save a little money if you just get all four. So one thing to be aware of is these are not like um, high-end collectible coins. If you buy something like at the US Mint or other coin manufacturers, you're gonna get a coin that's never been touched and it comes in the sealed plastic case. That's not what these are. These are just loose in a tray in the machine and you click the button and then one of them drops and you pick it up. So you will have um, little blemishes, little scrapes and stuff on your medallions. Um, some are gonna be better than others, but they are gonna have little imperfections on them just because that's how they're distributed. I have 24 medallions from Disneyland and 13 from Walt Disney World. I will give you a close up look at those in a little bit, but first let's look at the locations of all of these medallion designs. And just be aware that these are vending machines, so if a location isn't working out for some reason, they can just unplug it and move it to a new location. But as of right now, these are where the vending machines are located. So at the Disneyland Resort, there are 12 medallion machines. There are three in Disneyland, there are three in Disney's California Adventure, there are three in Downtown Disney, and there's one in each of the three Disney hotels. So I made this chart showing you the medallion machine locations and which designs each one has. So you can pause this video, take a screenshot of this chart, and then use it in the parks to find the ones you would like to collect. Um, here is the chart in black and white, which may make things easier if you're planning on like editing the picture in a photo editor and just marking the ones that you found. So the black and white one might be easier for you. Also, you're in luck if you're looking for these at Disneyland because there is another way to see the machine and design locations. You can open up the Disneyland app and you can hit the search button and then search for the word medallion and then click collectible medallion machines and then it will show you a list of all of the medallion machine locations and what designs are in each one. So it's the same information that's in my chart but it might be a little easier for you because it's in a list view. So at Walt Disney World there are 18 medallion machines located across the property. There are eight machines in the parks, there are three machines at Disney Springs, and seven machines in various resorts around the property. So I made this chart that shows you the medallion machine locations and which designs each one has. You can pause the video, take a screenshot of this chart, and then use it in the parks to find the ones you want to collect. Here is a black and white version of that same chart, which might make it easier if you're planning on editing this screenshot in a photo editor on your phone, and then you can mark the ones off that you found. So the black and white one might make that a little bit easier for you. 
Unfortunately, the Walt Disney World app doesn't have the medallion location list like the Disneyland app has. It does mention them in there in the pressed pennies area, but it just says, hey, we have a lot of these medallions, go find them all. So it doesn't give you a list, unfortunately. Here are the medallions that I have from Walt Disney World. We have Figment, Indiana Jones, BB-8, and Rocket and Groot. These are the four designs in the Epcot Port of Entry machine. These four are from the Polynesian Resort machine. We have Orange Bird, Ariel and Flounder, Moana with Maui, Pua, and Hey Hey, and Stitch. Here we have Vanellope, Maleficent, and Lightning and Mater. These are from three different machines. And here we have Anna, Elsa, Olaf, and Bruni, and then R2-D2. These are also from different machines. Here are the backs of the medallions. The Walt Disney World one has Mickey and Minnie inside the 100 logo, and it has Tinkerbell flying up at the top. The backs of the Disneyland coin have Flora, Fauna, and Meriwether up at the top. For my Disneyland medallions, here are the four designs from the Pirates of the Caribbean store. We have Madame Leota, the Hitchhiking Ghosts, the jail scene from Pirates, and the Pirates skeleton logo. This one has Luke Skywalker fighting Darth Vader, Yoda, Princess Leia with R2-D2, and Chewbacca with Han Solo. These are the four designs in the Space Mountain machine. Here we have Steamboat Willie, Mickey and Minnie, Sorcerer Mickey, and Chip and Dale. These are all from different medallion machines. This one has Snow White, Peter Pan with Wendy and Tinkerbell, and Dumbo with Timothy, all from different machines. And this one has Captain America, Buzz and Woody, and Simba with Timon and Pumbaa, and these are also all from different machines. These are not Disney 100 medallions. These are the Mandalorian medallions, and they are located in a machine in Galaxy's Edge. I have two designs, the Mandalorian symbol and Grogu. The other two designs are the Mandalorian and Ahsoka. The backs of the coins are what you see in the middle here. These are also not Disney 100 medallions. These are gold Tomorrowland medallions that are in a machine at the Space Mountain exit. I have all four designs, which are Star Tours, Autopia, the Monorail, and Space Mountain. The back of the coins have the Tomorrowland logo that you see here in the middle. I'm not sure if this machine is still there, but if it is, these are super nice. So I also wanted to show you the souvenir medallion collection book that you can get at Disneyland or at Walt Disney World. So it has the Disney 100 Years of Wonder, and if this looks familiar, this is the design that's on the back of the Walt Disney World medallions. I guess I have one right here. So you can see them right there, Mickey and Minnie in the 100, just like that. And I got this one from Disneyland, so it says Disneyland down here, but the Walt Disney World ones will say Walt Disney World. And then you open it up and it is a binder and it has these coin pages. So it can hold, each page can hold eight coins and there are 10 pages. So this book can hold 80 medallions, which you're not gonna be able to hold the whole collection in one book, but you could do all of Disneyland medallions in the Disneyland book and then get a Walt Disney World book and then put all the Walt Disney World ones in that book. These books are $24.99 each. And I have my medallions in here um, sorted by the machine. So this is the Pirates machine. I have all four, so that one's complete. I only have two from this machine, so I got two more to go. And I kind of just did it that way. So I only have one for this, so I know I need three. It's just a little easier to tell which ones I need. And then in the back, I put the gold Tomorrowland ones I have, and then the, the Mandalorian ones from Galaxy's Edge. So just put those in there. So yeah, it's kind of a good way to keep your coins so you can actually see them. You know, it just sits like that on the shelf. Um, it's blank on this side and blank on the back. But yeah, so really nice. Better than throwing them in a box, I guess. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed seeing the Disney 100 medallions and I hope this information was helpful for you for your next trip. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.